Hey there, welcome back to Coding Stuff. In this video, we are going to learn how to use dependent autocomplete text view in an Android Studio. So, we'll be creating this kind of app. We'll be using two autocomplete text view. And if I click on first autocomplete text view, I will get the country's name India, Japan, and USA. And if I select India, the autocomplete text view too will change according to first autocomplete text view. I will get the cities of India. Mumbai, Pune, Delhi, Nagpur. So I have mis made a mistake here. I have not tried. So I have created this design to save your time. I will just add to autocomplete text view and to image views of this vector assets. If you don't know how to add it, just uh, go to your resource folder in drawable at new and vector assets. Just add from here. Search your drop down you will get uh, this vector and just add it okay so now we'll link this with our java file so first we'll create uh, its reference objects so private autocomplete text view here yeah. just add autocomplete text view 1 2 and private what we have image view m image view 1 comma m image view 2 now we'll initialize it find we add r dot id dot autocomplete autocomplete to and now we'll initialize our images okay so now we'll just uh, paste here uh, string arrays of uh, first of countries and uh, will provide three cities cities arrays uh, for countries India Japan and USA okay so now we'll add array adapters new array adapter and it will take first parameter as a contest another as a layout and third is uh, a string array just copy paste it three times adapter 2 adapter 3 adapter 4 and here so it is 1 so it is 2 and so it is 3 okay so now we have created our string arrays and adapters so now we'll write the logic so first uh, we'll set adapter to our autocomplete text view 1 set adapter as adapter 1 and now autocomplete text 1 set on item click listener and insert that new on items click listener and we'll use a switch case so just write a switch and we'll pass the position whichever it whichever country has selected India Japan or USA so if India is selected means case 0 so what we gonna do we'll set uh, adapter to for our autocomplete text view 2 so just write here autocomplete text view 2 set adapter 
so adapter 2 so we'll just copy paste it sorry also we have to do uh, set on click listener to our image view so m image view 2 set on click listener new on click listener auto complete text view to show dot show drop down we also have to do it for this auto complete text view one so here we'll do it auto complete text view one dot sorry am image one view dot set on click listener new on click listener and we'll set we'll show the drop down here okay so this is it now we'll just copy this code two more times one more time just right here case two means position two case one and here adapter three adapter four uh, it's showing error because we have to make it final so we'll make it final okay the error is one so this is it now we'll run our app let's check everything is working or not so it has been installed so if i select india i'm getting countries or uh, cities of in india country and if i select japan i'm getting countries of japan if i select usa i will get cities of united states so now you can also add on click event uh, to to this auto complete text view too uh, you can show the toast or you can navigate to another activity and pass this text so this is it for now consider subscribing if you like the tutorials so thank you for watching